Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. In this video, we will learn about the switch all operator. So this is also comes under the join category operator. So what is this switch all? If you try to read this definition, converts a higher order observable into a first order observable producing values only from the most recent observable sequence. So whatever the inner observable that is occurred recently, so it will subscribe to that observable and it will generate the values so emitted by that inner observable. So that is a switch all. Now if you try to see here the, the parameters, there is no parameters for the switch all. And here if you try to see this marble diagram and in this marble diagram, now you will understand. Here we are having two inner observables emitting the data. So source observable is emitting an observable, observable of observables. First observable is emitting A, B, C, D and second observable is emitting E, F, G. Now when you pass through switch all operator, first what it will try to do is it will subscribe to the first inner observable. So one first inner observable it will subscribe. Now it will start emitting the values whatever the inner observable is emitting. So A, B, C when, when it is trying to emit the C, the second inner observable has been started. When the second inner observable has been started, now when it uh, the second observable start emits the data, it will unsubscribe to the first observable and it uh, subscribe to the second observable. So it switch switch to the second observable. So this is the switch switch all operator. So what the switch all operator will do is it will subscribe to the recent observable that has been created. It will leave this observable. So it will unsubscribe the observable if any new observable has been created. So this is about the switch all operator. Previously merge all operator what it will try to do it will subscribe to all the observables and whoever emits the data it will try to emit the data. But here the switch all operator whoever who, whatever the observable newly observable created it will unsubscribe to the previous observable and it will subscribe to the recent observable. So in this way it switch backs to the each observable like that. So this is about the switch all operator. Now let us try to see the practical implementation of this one. Now here I am creating mg gc pages slash switch all operator. <coughs> now if I go to the operators.component.html here I will add switch all switch all ok and here also I will add switch all and in the app routing let us go to the app routing and here I will create switch all ok and in this one I will where is the switch switch all yeah here I will create switch all switch all oh sorry switch all operator component let us go to the switch all same thing so whatever whatever we have seen the same thing now we have a source observable okay so interval so I will try to uh, do it very fastly so we have so I will take dot pipe of take 5 only so I will take only the take 5 so this is an interval now I will subscribe to this interval source dot sorry source dot subscribe to the data no console dot log data I will do console dot log data now for, for each value that is emitted by this parent interval in turn creates an inner observable let us assume so now here I am creating an inner observable of 1000 so for every one second this one also will emit the data and uh, let us uh, add this map in the imports map and here what I will try to do is so for this one I will take again the pipe operator of take 5 ok so that uh, we can have only the 5 values now for each value that is emitted by this interval parent interval so now here we are creating an inner observable now we can add something like switch all here ok switch all ok I can add this switch all that is it now whatever the inner observables that has been created here so whatever the inner observables that has been created here so it will switch back to the recent recent interval that has been created ok it will switch it will switch to the recent interval now if you try to see the output here let us go to the rxjs here in this operators let us go to the switch all now if you try to see here you will be able to 
what is this switch all right okay let's try to save this one we didn't save this switch all operate okay and the, now let's try to refresh this one I think it will automatically refresh yeah in the switch all we will be able to see 0 first and again 0 1 like that we will be able to see 0 first is printed and 0 1 2 3 4 5 4 4 only it has been printed so that means it has switched back so let's try to see the output so here we have used the switch all right now what I will try to do we will try to add map operator here so that we will observe what what is happening here now val will try to take and here i will add parent interval value will be dollar of value with the child interval which one it is taking we will need to understand so dollar of val that's it we are returning this value now let's try to see what what could be the output here we try to see this one now parent interval which one it is executing it is taking some time parent interval with a 4 see automatically it switch back to the fourth one so that means 0 1 2 3 has been gone so for example if i try to take this one as 500 let's try to see what could be the output here now if i try to see here so 0 with value 0 is taken again it switched back to the 1 again it switched back to the 2 3 and now 4 has been taken so now it is switching back to each interval why because so each time when it is trying to print the values for this one again new interval has been created by the parent interval so when the new in inner observable is created it will unsubscribe to the previous observable and it will subscribe to the new observable so for that reason first 0 it has subscribed with the, to the 0 and again one has been emitted so that is the reason why it has subscribed to the one leaving this one unsubscribing like this two three and four when it is subscribed there is no other value coming emitting emitted by the parent observable so that is the reason it is subscribed to the fourth pain fourth interval and it is giving and it is giving all the values that is emitted by the fourth inner observable so this is about the what i can say about the switch all operator now this all comes what i can say is uh, switch switch map and switch all this all comes under the same category only i will explain you about the difference between those three operators also in the coming videos so this is about the switch all operator so for, for from this we have learned about this join creation join operators not creation operators so you can also see the join creation operators also up to here we have learned so next onwards we are next in the next videos you will learn about the start with and with the latest from also so that you will understand so these all join operators then we will understand what is the difference between concat concat all and concat map switch map switch all these all things also will try to understand hope you understood about this uh, switch all operator also if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you